Hello, 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 y'all. I'm in the middle of a deserted parking lot and people think I've lost my mind. But I wanted to come on and do a quick video. This is going to be really quick because I'm starving. I went to Jersey Mike's and got a mini, which is like three inch tuna sandwich. I know. I had to do it. I, it's, it's like a tradition with me. Like if and when I go to Jersey Mike's, I always get Cheetos. So I got some Cheetos. And like Lady T would say, you know I had to do it. You know I had to get, if, if anywhere has a Diet Mountain Dew on tap as a fountain drink, it, it's a done deal for me. Oh my gosh. I know this is just a chemical train of, it's just chemicals and it's not good for you and I shouldn't be eating it. Just know that. And I want to show you, but I don't want to take my keys out of the ignition. This is the Bath & Body Works Marshmallow Fireside Hand Sanitizer, y'all. This stuff. And I think this is still from my Julie, Three Dogs Mom. Oh my gosh. This stuff, every time I put it on, I get so many compliments. And I've been saving it. Oh my gosh, y'all. It, it reminds me of my Marshmallow, marshmallow Fireside Candles. God, it kind of makes me depressed because it's no longer time for that. Mmm! All right, let's get right down to it, shall we? Let's look into what this sub looks like. I hope everybody's having a good day. It's a workflow day for me, um, but we're halfway there. This is gonna be really messy too. Oh, and they still cut it in half. See, this is enough. That's my hand. This is a mini. Um, so let me, I'm just gonna have this down here as like a trough. Can y'all even see that? It's so bright in here today. Mmm, their tuna y'all is so good. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. This has provolone, tuna, mayonnaise, pickles, tomatoes. I was gonna get onions, but they linger, if you know what I mean. Mm. And I gotta go be social the rest of the day. Can't be smelling like an onion that I dug up out of the yard. Do you ever do that in the South? That's real Southern, honey. If you've got onions growing in your backyard and you use them as food, that's when you know you're a real Southerner. If you have a Jersey Mike's near you, I implore you to go. It is a lot better than Subway, I'm just saying. Mm. And their pickles are super crunchy, super delicious. Here's just another reminder. Head over. Head over to my sushi video, I'll put the link below, and ask your questions for my Ask Me Anything video, which is coming up later this week. This is your chance, y'all. This is your chance to get your questions in. The deadline for those questions is Wednesday, 5 p.m. Eastern Time. There's a huge semi truck behind me. I'm also looking in this little shopping center, and there's a Dollar General there. Y'all know I'm a Dollar Tree fan, right? I'm not big into the Dollar General. I feel like they're overpriced for what it is. I feel like you can get the same stuff at Walmart for way cheaper. Yes, y'all, it's Cheeto time. This is gonna. I feel like I need Tracy B. I need my little um, grabbers that you and your mom used to use for Cheetos so you don't get orange fingers. Little tongs, so to speak. Mm. I love Cheetos so much. None of that flame and nonsense, honey. Give me normal, delicious, cheesed or cheat. I always thought it was 
Oh, it is Chester. Chester Cheetah. Cheetah. There it goes. The storm clouds, honey, are rolling in. The questions have been hilarious so far that I've seen. It's going to take me a while to answer these, which I'm glad about. And some of y'all are doing like 20 questions per thing. They ain't messing around now. Here's the other half. Okay, truck, can you enough? I'm over you. Can you get out of my life? Go away. This whole parking lot they can choose and they're right behind me. Don't they know I'm doing a mukbang? A lunch bong. Now, the thing is you have to squeeze this properly so you don't squeeze the tuna out on the other side. Isn't that attractive? Mmm. I'm a little bit wary of tuna from most places because it tends to be a little bit fishy. And if your tuna smells like the lake, I have a problem with that. But Jersey Mike's tuna, y'all, is the best I've ever had. It's very plain, very not fishy tasting, but also very peppery. It's just good. Mm. And this mini is more than enough for a meal. Those pickles, did you hear that? So yes, I have to go back to work. I have literally, y'all, been so crazed at work for the past probably three weeks that I currently have about six to-do lists. So I'm so excited. When I get back, I'm going to put a note on my door that says, unless the rapture has occurred, unless the zombie apocalypse has occurred, don't come in here because everybody wants to come in and talk to me. I, I, I don't. I'm locking myself in, I'm, I'm condensing my to-do lists into one, I'm putting dates on it, I'm cleaning, excuse me, my desk, and I'm getting organized, and I'm going to go through my emails. That's my commitment to y'all. I'm, I'm putting it out there in the cosmos, so I'm going to make it happen. You got to speak it. You got to speak the truth into the world, and it will occur. So that's what I'm doing today. When I get back, I will have about four hours before my next class classes and all you Tony fans I'm heading to Pigeon Forge on Thursday so be on the lookout for some Tony videos if y'all don't know Tony works at Dollywood and he is in full swing honey they just opened this past Friday He's in the gym tones, which is sort of like a 50s doo-wop style type group. Hmm. I'm also looking at Ollie's Bargain Outlet. Good stuff, cheap. Not really that much of a fan in my area. I feel like it's very hit or miss. Plus the fact that I was looking at my house the other day, y'all. I don't need any more knickknacks. I don't have any room for anything. In fact, you know what I need to do? What I need to do is go through and get rid of stuff. Because I have got so many... There's another tractor trailer. I've got so many knickknacks and bric-a-bracs and elephants and geometric shaped creatures and vases and snow globes and cats and it's ridiculous and the more junk you have the more stuff you have to dust can I get an amen from that hmm. I was gonna go to Dollar Tree today y'all and I was like you're not it's intervention time forget it don't you're not doing it I'm grounding myself for at least a week. 
because you want to talk about useless crap that you buy, the Dollar Tree honey will get you every time up and down the street. I'm like, but I really need this rubber pot holder. Do I? Do I? The answer is no, I don't. Do I need any of that stuff? Probably not. But, I watch all these hauls of all these people buying Dollar Tree stuff, and I'll tell you who got me started. is Stephanie Couponing Girl. She was, I think, my first experience with Dollar Tree videos. It was all downhill. It was all she wrote, honey. Case closed. Get over it. It's, it's done now because once that got in my brain, I was like, well, I want to go see what my Dollar Tree has every single week, at least twice a week. And I'm one of those people. Honey, if I go in the Dollar Tree, I got to get a buggy. I don't, don't, don't mess with the cart. Don't, I don't want a shopping basket. I, I need a buggy. And then you just fill it up. I know Donna from Donna's Journey said that's why she don't even get a buggy, which is probably a wise decision. I think Stephanie and I are going to try the couponing girl. She lives somewhat near me. We're going to try to do a meetup soon. I can't even imagine doing a Dollar Tree raid with my girl Stephanie. Talk about fun. It's almost gone, y'all. I'm sad. Mm. I've been watching Planet Earth 2 on Netflix. If y'all if y'all have Netflix and you're just bored and want to have something on the background, that show is amazing. And the cats are obsessed with watching it. They literally watch it the entire time it's on. It, it's hilarious to me. Any other time the TV is on, they could care less. Tuna that has escaped. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, let me finish up these Cheetos. See, look, fingers, see? I love Cheetos, but I don't like what they do. And then if you're really, just don't care, you can eat them that way. Mm. We all know them and love them, honey. These people in the trucks, go away. They're having some kind of a meeting. I'm gonna go ask them if they've ever seen the Tyler Ramey YouTube channel. And would they like to like, comment, and subscribe? I'm pretty sure the answer to all those questions would be no. All right, y'all. Gotta get back to the grind. Mm-hmm. That is exactly what I wanted. You know when you have something in your mind that you wanna eat and then you eat it and you're like, that's it, that is exactly what I wanted and needed? That was it. All right, y'all. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This Give this video a big thumbs up. Find me on social media, T Ramey one on Instagram, Tyler Ramey on Facebook. Excuse me. Don't forget to ask your questions on the Ask Me Anything. The description to that video is in the link below. And you have until Wednesday, 5 p.m. Eastern, to get your questions in for me to answer on a upcoming video. I love y'all, and I mean it. Goodbye.